So what he's trying to say is we didn't land on the moon, right? No, it landed on us. So. What's up, fight fans? Welcome back to another reaction here at Three Shades or whatever. Uh. Buddy sent me this the other day, and I watched like the first 10 seconds of it, and I was like, nope, this is going on the channel. Yeah. I I talked to him a little about it, but what I heard, but he hasn't heard shit. And uh, I've heard a good amount of it, and I'm, I'm not even going to lie, I, this is more of a discussion for me. I thought it was interesting. I stopped right away. I had to. Let's watch it. Listen, I, all right, Bryce Mitchell himself, love him as a fighter. He's an amazing He's wrestler. He's a good dude, too. But if this is real... And this guy has potential to make it to the top of the, his division. So let's see. Let's see. Hey, I'm here to call out Joe Rogan for talking crap about me and talking crap about my mama. He's been doing it for too long. Me and my mama will tell you right now this earth is flat. It ain't moving around at no 600-something thousand miles an hour, spinning a thousand miles an hour, and floating through the universe constantly okay this earth is flat it's fixed and the stars and stuff rotate around us the sun rotates around us okay and i can prove that so we're asgard <laughs> but wait, wait wait okay so here all right so here's the question right off the bat and asgard yes is he trolling right now i need to watch to the end to know we in the comments Please, is Bryce Mitchell, Mitchell trolling or not? And yes, watch the whole thing. We're going to have to get through the whole thing for you to decide. But when he says, I'm tired of him talking about me and my mama. That's how that's that talks. That's the part where I'm Talk like, is this a mama. joke? Yeah. But then he looks serious. I'm like, are you that good of an actor? I believe what you're saying right now. Let's just see more. Well, you know, mama always said alligators are ornery because they got all those teeth and no toothbrush. Mm-hmm. That I would love to debate you, Joe Rogan, because I'm tired of you making fun of flat earthers. And if you're so confident, come on and debate me, buddy, because I'm tired of this crap you're posting. You want to post a video today um, about a mathematician that says the universe is local, but it ain't real. What does that even mean? That's a bunch of mumbo jumbo crap, brother. I look at you with an expression of exhaustion and ever so slight amusement. <laughs> And the guy is holding a trident in the picture. And y'all think I'm crazy for thinking that this is a religious thing. He's holding a trident, a symbol of the devil. They're trying to feed... I, I you know... He's 100% serious, dude. Uh, that's the thing. As it that goes along... That might have that might have kicked it into serious mode right <laughs> He means this shit, dog. Uh, this is... Um, uh, look... Yeah, let's Mama see more Sarah and then Dancing talk. Mama is the devil. Ow! <laughs> it's the brain pain, coat. I have to see more before I... I don't want to say anything. I gotta get to the end, because maybe at the end he's like, got ya! <laughs> feed you these lies to make you think that science is right and that, that God didn't create this universe the Big Bang did. Okay, I used to be an atheist, because I used to believe that... This universe was created by the Big Bang. I used to believe all that crap from Neil deGrasse Tyson, okay? And I'm just so sick and tired of hearing your crap, Joe, about flat earth, uh, flat earthers being stupid. Boy, I'll smoke you in a debate. You, you, I will smoke you, and, and there ain't nothing you can do beat me in a debate, brother, because you ain't got no proof. Gravity ain't real. It's density. It's paper. <laughs> When it drops, it's because it's more dense than the air around it, not because of some magical thing called gravity. There is no proof of gravity, brother. There's only proof of density. That's why hot air balloons float, because of hot air being less dense, okay? Not because a hot air balloon is an anti-gravitational device. And I will debate you right to your face, and I'm tired well, of this of crap that you're posting. I'm tired of you making fun of flat earthers because you got one right here that will bring it to you and i know you won't accept this challenge actually no i don't know but i bet you won't i bet you'll sissy out 
and that crap you're posting, it's leading people away from the Holy Spirit. This this universe wasn't created from no Big Bang. I don't care what Neil deGrasse Tyson says. And we didn't land on the moon. And Neil deGrasse Tyson knows we didn't land on the moon. He's lying about it too. Okay? All these people are lying, brother. And all you're doing is leading people away from the Spirit. When When you understand that God created this universe, then you'll understand that there's no need for all this big bang and this and that and, and it's all a bunch of crap that's why the stars the little dipper and the big dipper are in the same position they've always been in because the universe ain't constantly expanding uh i gotta just go that way wait. uh oh this is a reverse lap yeah this is a backwards but, uh, lap a backwards lap wait a minute he said that, no he's he said serious that, wait, no, hold, on, hold on hold on he said that the little dipper and the big dipper are always in the same spot because the universe ain't expanded. What the fuck kind of logic is that? There is, there is no. Well, that's one of the worst. Okay, comments. so look, wait, no wait, hold on, hold on. Look, I'm gonna show you something. It look. doesn't expand at the hey, speed Bryce, of your eyesight. Hey, Bryce, check it out. Look, look, look. This is the shape of the little dipper, right? Here's the universe. It's here already. The universe is growing. Guess what's not moving? Cause it's there already. <laughs> well, also that's okay. Good point by you, but also fuck's sake, man. Also, how does he say it's always? First of all, the rate of the the universe expansion is not something you're going to see with the naked eye. Yeah. So, you know, first of all, there's multiple layers to this. There, you know, it, it's the not like every in the stupidery. The stupidery. <laughs> you made up a new word. Man. I did on purpose. Yeah. But now, but here's the thing. You could believe certain, like, I'm trying, I'm trying, I want to say, because I don't want to make this a religious thing. I want to, you could believe that God created the universe. Sure. Okay. It doesn't change the fact of what things are happening around us. When, he, when he brings up Big Bang, I, I, you know, I don't even care about that much of the Big Bang thing, but more when he's talking about the earth is flat and everything revolves around us. There's so much, there's a preponderance, it's called... In the scientific community, it's called a preponderance of evidence that the Earth is round. Why are we talking about it? I have no idea. Flat There's Earth, pictures yeah. of the goddamn Earth. Somehow, pictures, the other, and it's round. Okay, so look, the Earth, I mean the Moon, round. Venus, round. Mars, round. Jupiter, round. The Earth is a fucking frisbee flying through the universe. <laughs> and also, the density thing, he's mixing two things. The density does play a role sure. in gravity. Like what I don't know what away from gravity. I don't know what his point was. So we didn't land on the moon, but the <gasps> landing on the moon it, it is a proof of how gravity works because you weigh less on the moon. There it is. There's not things that are this dense and that dense. If you but end up on Jupiter, your body will be sucked to the friggin' planet. But, it's, but what about when you're in space and things just float there? They don't go anywhere. Yeah, density doesn't matter. It's not that things matter, just go. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> things will just Science continuously works. go. You you, you know. But again, even if you try to use that ev evidence, the preponderance of evidence, you're going to use either it's fake as the rebuttal or God, it, you're going to go into a God thing. That's that's what I don't like about that. It's like if somebody says you're you're wrong, you could be wrong because we have this evidence. They're going to be like, well, they're, li they're lying to you. They're lying to you. Somebody told <laughs> Why you. Why does it always have that, that accent way? when this shit comes around? Right, right. <laughs> yeah. Damn it, hey, I look here, boy, I'll tell you what, I'll debate you all day long, and I'll tell you this earth is flat and you're stupid. <laughs> <laughs> and then you gotta cross your eyes and say, yes, the earth is flat and y'all stupid. Yeah. Wait, there's a bait and there's a debate. Go away, baiting. I blame fake news for this. It, well, yes. No, I, I mean, look. Misinformation, but not the way people think it is. Right. Right. This is real misinformation. People that are... Look, the problem with this, this kind of shit is this is a product of the fucking internet, okay? You get a bunch of jackasses that think the same thing or somebody hears an idea and they say, oh, I'm going to believe that now too. And now they're a fucking community. And then you get this shit. I will debate you all day long about this earth is flat. We ain't spinning. We ain't going no 600,000 yeah. miles through the fucking universe. And y'all can't say because y'all have no proof. And it's yeah. like... What proof do you have that it's flat? I mean... What? The, the fucking Infinity War when they show Asgard from space? <laughs> <laughs> what you say about my mama? Drop Captain. Looks like Boucher knocked him off cold. I love my mama very much. Now you know that. He, dude, I'm, when he, as soon as he started off with that, dude, I was I almost wanted to fucking fall out laughing. Stop talking crap about me and stop talking crap about my mama. Listen, That's why the, I thought it might have been a joke. Yes, dude, we see, as the video went You know on. who it reminded me of? It reminded me of Red Man from How High. Is that all, Mama?
I have no issue with the religious standpoint on things. No, I don't care religious. about that. I'm, so a I'm attacking. I'm it's, attacking stupid uh, shit. It's just, you, it sounds Flatters. so... What the fuck, dude? It sounds so dumb. And I, listen, there may be, like, facts that flat earthers have, and somebody can intelligently debate their position. <laughs> Maybe. I do not believe the earth is flat. I believe there is a preponderance of evidence that the earth is round. Oh, also, yes. the fact that you could actually ch keep traveling and end up in the same spot eventually if you fly through the freaking air. Well, what, what you happened? could also see... Can, can I ask you this? You when a ship is floating in, in, at the sea and you watch the ship going away from you, where the fuck does it go? Off. It falls. You know. Oh. But it, but it, but it kind of floats. And, yeah. and then it comes back. It's like the Bermuda Triangle just warps back to the we other side. We also have a telescope that takes pictures of these things in space, not just the Earth, the other planets. Yeah. So the other planets are fully round, and we can see it. And we have, But they're lying to you, brother. Yeah. They're lying to it's, you. It's, it's, it's a it's, bunch of mumbo-jumbo yeah, to take you taking away, away from, from the, the spirit. Holy Spirit. You need the Spirit in your life. That's the problem I have when somebody throws the religious stuff at you. Is go, hey, here's my evidence. Exhibit A, and they said, "Well, they're lying to you. They're taking you away from the Holy Spirit. They don't want you to go to the Holy Spirit. That is yeah. a lie." That face that he was making that whole time he, made me think that he was playing. Yeah, I know, but that's the problem. The face he was making was a condescending look because he believes so deeply that he's right that he thinks that everybody else around him is stupid. When it's the fucking opposite. So what are the what are our people? What do our people think? Was that a was that an elaborate troll? Did he just troll us? Yo, imagine if we're sitting here reacting to this and this guy was a joke the whole time. I will, I will <coughs> give him major props if that's well, the case. Got me! I tell you what, <laughs> there will be in a the big time section, got him. What? In the comment section, you guys can debate whether or not yeah. it was a troll or not. I don't want to debate on, on this. No, because I'm not going to debate. There is no fucking no, no, debate. No, no, no. If you believe it, sorry, you're wrong. You guys don't want to debate. I'm not debating a the damn There's thing. There's a debate I want to do. But it but doesn't start with D. If you don't stop it, you'll go blind. Well, what else do I say? I mean, I tried to, to go into it, it? lighthearted and not let him annoy me with stupidity. But God, dude, it got worse and worse. Like, it's like you ever look at one of those pictures that the longer you look at it, the worse it gets? <laughs> that was this. Yeah, that, that was definitely this. You know what I mean? The longer you listen, the worse it got. And it's like, I cannot believe that he truly believes this shit. I will debate you. There ain't nothing you can say, brother. What? What the fuck are you going to say? I need to hear the debate. You you you're, you won't invite me on the show because I'm going to debate. You're going to be scared to debate me because yeah. you got no... Clue. I'll bet you you won't. Now that's another a bit thing. like the game. Here's another Please thing. Please respond. Also to comment yeah. on, do we get a Joe Rogan, Bryce Mitchell debate if it's not a troll? I, I think so, yeah. Because I think Joe Rogan will chew him up and spit him out. It's Joe, yeah, but sometimes Joe Rogan just straight up ignores... Yeah, it, it could be... An In certain instances, you, sh you can't. You should, and you can and should. But in this he instance... He could black Slim Shady him. Yeah, That's I think what we're calling he, it. he might black Slim Shady I don't him. think so. I don't think so. He's a fucking UFC fighter, man. And Joe Rogan is big in the UFC. You can't just ghost him. You're going to see him in the fucking halls. And instead of having that conversation behind closed doors, I want to see it. You know what I call that video? This is my nickname for that video. Butthole cringe. Yeah. Because it was so cringy that my butthole took a little I can't bit. believe that he Did was saying Did you ever get butthole cringe you... level? No. It's a thing, dude. It's a thing, man. Somebody's so cringy to the point where you're like, ooh, that hurt my butt a little bit. You see, now that ooh is plausible. Ooh. ooh. <laughs> this has gone bad. Well, I don't yeah, know what else to say bad, about it. I don't know how much bad. more mumbo jumbo we could say about bad. this. Dog, that, that's... Forget Bryce, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Jeez. What you just said was mumbo jumbo. Lola.